so as I was editing, editing, like, cutting things out, I guess you can say, uh, I realized that I was, like, I never say, like, like or subscribe to my channel, um, so, yeah, if you guys want to do that before we get started down there, like, just a little like, subscribe, I would greatly appreciate it. Morning, y'all. Um, I'm, like, not a morning person at all, but I just got up and had breakfast, and I had, like, egg whites and jasmine rice. I'm doing, like, this meal plan to drop some weight, hopefully, fingers crossed. Um, and I had a really long day at MD Anderson yesterday, um, so I apologize for looking like this, like, my eyelashes need to be brushed and my hair needs to be something done to it. Um, but I thought that I would share my skin routine with you guys, uh, morning and night. Uh, I have a pretty intense skincare routine and, uh, you know, the skin just doesn't come magical or anything. So, uh, yeah, I just thought I would share that with you guys and, um, okay, we'll get started on the morning one. Alright, I'm back. Hair's still looking crazy. Let me fix that real quick. Okay, so I put my hair up, and I always uh, wash my face in the morning regardless. Um, I have pretty dry skin, but sometimes, like, especially if I'm feeling bad at night, um, and if you know, like, with lymphoma, you get night sweats, that's, like, a symptom. So, sometimes my face will be kind of oily, so I always wash it in the morning no matter what, just because, like, it wakes you up, you know, makes you feel refreshed, whatever. So, my go-to face wash, hands down, is Tula. It is just the Cult Classic Purifying Cleanser. It's for, like, any type of skin, and it's, like, the, I swear it's the best. Like, it, um, I mean, it's just such a natural cleanse. Um, it doesn't strip away, um you know the good oils it's got probiotics and superfoods it's a really good skincare cleanser for morning and night so um i'll wash my face and i'll show you guys how it kind of like uh bubbles up which i have to have in a cleanser because like i don't like anything that doesn't foam uh but yeah so i'll show you that real quick Like, I literally just use like a dime size, and it is like the best. Look at all that foam, the best. I always like wash away, I don't know why um and like on my chin like all washed down because i got this double chin yeah anyways uh so yeah that's a cleanser i'm gonna rinse it off really quick okay so i washed it off skin's clean now my eyelashes are wet so they're gonna, gonna be mad at together just ignore that um okay so once I like kind of like pat dry my face, I always use a toner. Um, in the morning time, I really like this toner. It's called Byroe. This is what it looks like. Um, I'll try to link it down below, but it's a bitter green essence toner. I think it's really good for the morning because it's like super refreshing. So I just like put a little bit of it on a cotton ball and you know, make sure to get like the T-zone for the toner. Um, cause that's like where I hold my oil is like in between the, my nose. But again, I'm super dry. Chemo dried out my skin so bad. So yeah, I do that. Look, that's like probably from yesterday. <laughs> it's a really, really good toner. Um, so yeah, I'll let that dry a little bit, 
And then I like to go in with serum before moisturizer. Uh, scientifically, like serum should be used before moisturizer because the moisturizer can penetrate the serum, but the serum can't penetrate the moisturizer. So it's basically like if you don't um, do it before, it's pointless. This is also Biro E. Biro, Biro E. I don't even know. It's, it's not focusing, but I'll link it. This is a tomato serum, and it says, I apply a few drops to the face and neck morning and night, can be used daily. I only use this in the morning because I use a lot of the Tula products at night, but I barely just take any because I don't want to be oily, and I use a couple of other, more th other things, and I'll just, again, like rub it out on my neck. Forehead and let that dry for a minute. So I, I just started a diet. Um, again, what's new? I'm always trying to diet. Um, but no, so like uh, during chemo, like I gained like 75 pounds, so I haven't felt normal. Um, I've lost quite a bit of it, um, you know, on my own. Just like I guess just being normal again and like being active and stuff like that but um I don't know there's I still have a lot to lose but um so like I just started the diet on on Monday I think so what say yeah so like two days ago and <laughs> you like get on the scale right and you're like oh come on like I've been eating so good like I've been starving <laughs> like should not fall asleep no the scale hasn't moved <laughs> I even like took all my clothes off, I was like, okay, maybe this bra is like a little, you know, a few ounces. <laughs> like, no, it hasn't moved. So, don't get discouraged. But the reason I was like also bringing up the diet is because uh, sometimes my skin will freak out when I'm like doing anything different with my body. I take a lot of meds. And so, um, that's why I'm like super vigorous about my skincare. Um, so, okay, uh, we'll move on. Uh, after that, I do the moisturizer, and this is too that I've used it for years. All through chemo treatment, it was great. Um, this is the 24-7 Moisture Hydrating Day and Night Cream. I'll link all these things below for you guys. But it's it's really good. Like You really just need a little bit because it's so, like, I don't want to say it's thick because it isn't. Um, it's just... It's just good <laughs> you're you feel super moisturized like not dried out um, also like drink a lot of water of course um, so in the morning I always use my the sunscreen the Tula sunscreen um, it's protect and glow it's a really really good thing whether you're working out like sometimes I'll go ride my bike or whether you're just if you want to wear any your makeup because it gives you this glowy look like it's kind of yellowish I don't know if you can see it but it's a very good sunscreen it is 30 SPF and it doesn't feel like a sunscreen like it doesn't leave a film so like I'll wear it like today I'll probably go ride my bike I don't feel very good today but I'm gonna try to feel better <laughs> um, so yeah definitely recommend this again one of the best sunscreens I've ever used. This is a blurring primer. I just use that under my makeup uh, because it's probably one of the best like no makeup makeup looks. Like all you have to do is use this prim this uh, primer and it like fills in your pores so almost where your skin is like butter. Yeah. Okay, like I know this video is probably gonna be weird because I'm like looking everywhere, but one of my friends was like, I noticed you film uh <laughs> like upwards. Is that your preference? And I'm like, no, but I film on my phone, so if I put it sideways on my tripod, I don't know where, <laughs> where the camera is. So yeah, I'm like looking everywhere, but you get the gist. I'm here. Um okay, so then I 
love, love, love this eye balm. It's Rose Glow and Get It Cooling and Brightening Eye Balm. Again, by Tula, my favorite. So I just take it and I put it under here. And don't freak out like I did in the beginning. I didn't read it. I just got, I just like, I need an eye cream because I'm a nurse at school and some days y'all know how it is and so i got that and it's very cooling so don't freak out about that and then the last thing i do for the day is the just like the the spray like refreshing spray it's the signature glow refreshing and brightening face mist you see you can use this all um in the morning the night throughout the day it's just a good refreshing thing and um I also take the Tula Pro Daily Probiotics. Here's proof that I already took it today. Like I said, I take my meds in the morning before breakfast and stuff. So here's proof that I did it. And then I um, also take these Biotin gummies. I got these off Amazon, but I've ordered like three bottles since the first time I got them. So and my hair is growing. My skin stays good. My eyelashes are good. So yeah. Get them. I'll link them. So yeah, I'll um, link everything and oh, I'll see you guys back tonight for my night skincare routine. It contains more tula. <laughs> um, it's not sponsored or anything, and I've used it for years, and I highly, highly recommend it for any skin type. So yeah, I'm gonna finish taking my vitamins and uh, go get my day started. It's gonna consist of a lot of studying. Oh, I kind of flipped the script. <laughs> For a second um because i just kind of wanted to just get, show you guys like what i was doing today um and how i've got like everything like set up and stuff um it's a mess so and i'm sure like if you're a nurse at school you feel me <laughs> but yeah so um and i also really want to talk about something too that i think will help everybody um so let's see so i'll show you my setup let me switch this around Okay, I studied all night last night um, after I got back from MD Anderson. We have Pitocin calculations coming up, so uh, if you know, mm, you know about that. Um, I have a pen problem. <laughs> so this is like what it's like after I study. Like this is what it looks like. These are my, you know, calendars. I'm kind of not going to try to show everything there, but like, test grades and my calendar it's kind of crazy but yeah so the main thing that I wanted to talk about and share with you guys especially if you're staring at the computer all day like I know like I have an iPad and a desktop and a MacBook so I'll like go back and forth on what I use like whatever's comfortable for me um and I wanted to talk about these glasses they're like the blue light blocking glasses which I've had some for forever the Baxter blues um, I think I used these like all through the first year of nursing school and I, I really do like these too but these like I just came across them on Facebook and they're so high quality I literally only spent like 20 bucks on them and the brand is called Cyxus C-Y-X-U-S I'll link them below too um but they're super cute I'll show you okay I was trying to like dim the light to where you guys can see them they're, you can see like everything on my computer, sorry, but I'm just trying to show them, they're like super cute, I don't know if you guys think they're cute, but I think that they're cute, and um, like I can study for hours and like not stress about it, the quality is just incredible, like it's just super um, durable, like and I wouldn't think like, oh, you know, I was going to go on Amazon and get a few pairs, which I did that too, but these turned out to be my favorite, um and like the Baxter Blues are nice they're like more of a plastic material I do like these too um they're just smaller and I feel like my face is kind of like too big for them but um I really like oversized uh glasses and like the keys like I use the high key sunglasses so yeah they're they're super cute too um, but yeah, I wanted to share these with you because, I mean, for 20 bucks and as high quality as they are, I was like, yeah, nursing students need to know about this. So yeah, um, uh, I'm going to get studies, 
see I'm brain dead I'm gonna get started studying and yeah I'll see you guys tonight after I stay up late so <laughs> it'll probably be like midnight when I'm like doing my skincare routine and I'm gonna treat these acne spots too and I'll show you what I use for that because of stress but um yeah thanks guys uh for staying along this far and see what's you. up guys I'm back for the nighttime skincare routine let's do it I gotta get all my accessories off and we'll clean our face Okay, I went and changed my shirt too because I don't want anything on my blouse. So, okay. <sighs> I've been out for the day. You can kind of see that my skin's like flaring up. I'm really stressed and I had um, a lot of stuff go on yesterday at MD Anderson. So, I had a lot of meds and it's messing with me right now. But I'm going to show you the night, what I do before I go to bed. And so, uh, again, we'll just start with what I normally use, and that is the Tula face wash that I showed in the morning. So it's the same, that doesn't change. And so I'll wash my face, and um, yeah. <laughs> I'm so glad that I changed shirts because, like, I'm so messy. <laughs> okay. So, I wash my face super clean and fresh. No leftover makeup. Um, so at nighttime is when I exfoliate. Again, I have super dry skin. People say, there you hear rumors like, don't exfoliate if you have dry skin, it dries you out more. That's not true. You still need to remove your dry skin. And I just got the new Tula uh, by Sean Johnson. Um, it's like a pumpkin scrub, so it's perfect for fall. It smells so good and it leaves your skin feeling so good too so I use this on I use it like two to four times a week and then I heavily exfoliate um, at least once a week um, and I'll link what I exfoliate I heavily but I'm not gonna do it today because I've already done it um, but yeah so I'm gonna use this it's just a dime size amount you can hear it. it's like a light syrup I don't know if you can hear that but um, yeah so then I just scrub I have sensitive skin so even the slightest like you're gonna see it's gonna change and it's gonna get a little red but that's normal because that's how my skin is so I just scrub with that and then we rinse all right so that's cleansing and exfoliating. Just dry my lashes here a little bit. They like to get clumped up. All right, so nighttime products. So I go in with the Tula um, toner. This is a pro glycolic 10% pH resurfacing gel. I really like to use this at night because um, it's just like that extra deep clean while you're sleeping so your skin can just soak it all in and like resurface overnight. So I really like that. Um, and it does a good job like getting whatever you leave behind. Um, see, like that's after cleaning. I mean, it's not terrible, but um, I mean, if you weren't to use this, I feel like the cleanser and everything just does like a perfect job. So the next thing I do is the Illuminating Face Serum by Tula at night. Like I said in the beginning, serums before moisturizers always because the serums can, uh, like the moisturizer can penetrate the serums, but the serums can't penetrate the moisturizer. It's just science, y'all. Just listen. Okay, so. 
I'm gonna put that everywhere. And like, I love these products because they're like not super, like the, the scent is so nice and they're not harsh. Like, and it has probiotics and superfoods. This says it's a lightweight serum expert. X really targets dark spots and dull skin, revealing a youthful glow and brightened complexion. I don't know how youthful I look, but I am only 27, so I'm still pretty young. Um, and that can be used morning and night, but I use the other serum in the morning, uh, especially under my makeup because I'm so dry. Um, and then, so I'll go in with the moisturizer that I used this morning. The Tula 24-7 Moisturizer. You guys, I literally go through a, a jar of this probably like once every two months. Like, I just got this and you can see like it's, cause I mean, I use it morning and night. Like even if I go out to the bar, which hasn't been happening since the Corona, but let's just say I get super wasted or hammered. I still make it a point to do my skincare, whether it's half-assed or whatever. I still do it. Um, so yeah, I use that a lot. And then um, I still go in with the cooling eye balm cream because it's just nice, like overnight. There's one from Tulu that I really want to get, and it's like a a depuffing gel that goes under. I just haven't um, taken the time to get it. You know, I've, I'm, I'm busy like all the time. So then um, that's like pretty much all the skincare. And then I have like two acne spots. I know it's gonna be like, girl, that's not acne, but for real it is. And whenever I get it, it's like cystic. So it's under the skin and it's from stress. So this is the Go Away Acne Spot Treatment by Tula. And it's really cool because I like the end that it has on it. It's just like a pin. So you just put a little bit on there and like rub it in and it almost smells kind of minty like toothpaste you know how your mom like back in the day would be like put some toothpaste on it I don't know that wife's tell I think it really does work so yeah I do that let it dry and then yeah I'm good to go to bed put on my pajamas and I'll probably read my book a little bit before I go to sleep, and yeah. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the skincare routine. This is like the finished product. Um, it's pretty clean, feel glowy, dewy. So yeah, um, I highly, highly recommend Tula. Um, I endorse it. Um, it's just a really, really good skincare line. I don't think that the prices are outrageous. I think it's pretty affordable. Um, and there's several like people out there who you can just use their codes and get like 15% off. Um, so yeah, that's what I do. And everyone always asks me about my skin. So here's your tutorial. Um, thanks for tuning in guys. And um, like I said, I'll link everything below and yeah. I don't know, I know my videos are kind of random, but I'm trying to stick to like just about my life. It's kind of crazy, so I'll do a little bit of this, a little bit of that. I think the next one I'm going to sit down and um, show you how I like plan out like my nursing schedule and what I do to get ready and prepare for school and tests and things like that. And then um, maybe the next one I'll even play the piano and sing for you guys a little bit. I need to get back into playing. Um, it's always been a passion of mine, so, yeah. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and catch you next one.